I've been dancing for probably 15 years now. Um, but every time I get into the studio, I do feel like I'm transforming. I'm just so interested in showing a different perspective of human emotion and stuff that isn't spoken word. I can use my body, I can use my head, my neck, my torso. I'm really intrigued with, with the human body and learning about muscles and um, kinesthetic function. As a part of this degree, we um, have to do a few dance science courses, um, dance anatomy, dance science, and uh, a conditioning class. I think that um, dance science knowledge, anatomy knowledge, is really crucial for anyone, athlete or just recreational. Um, it helps you stay safe, it helps you increase the longevity of your career. I study dance injuries and I study how we can identify dancers who might be at a greater risk of injury and then we also examine how much of a problem injuries are in different dance populations. We work specifically on muscle strength that is designed to support the dancers in their technical training. So a lot of hip strengthening, um, a lot of core strengthening. Um, these are the muscles that we really are engaging in a functional way that if they are strong, then when they get to their technique class, they don't have to think about recruiting particular muscles. They can focus on the quality of movement that they're, that they're producing. One of the unique things about dance is that really it's based on tradition. The teaching of dance is based on tradition. With the influx of kinesiology, with the influx of scientific research about dancers, we're now able to bring in appropriate warm-up and cool-down that may not necessarily have been addressed in that traditional trajectory of teaching dance. Embedded within our dance curriculum is the content that students need to learn how to teach safely and to learn the components of fitness so we can target some complementary training, to learn foundations of nutrition and hydration. And this education is one of the fundamental pieces that we can um, impart in preventing injuries among the dance population. And so this is really where empowering and educating the next generation of dance teacher is so valuable.